Hello everyone and welcome to Aviation A to Z. The aviation is really fascinating and there are various unspoken things about it and one of that is airport versus aerodrome. What are the differences, what are the similarities and why we use both terms. So today we will unwrap the complete mysteries and compare both airport and aerodrome in detail. So let's get started. Let's see what this term actually means. According to dictionary, there are lots many definitions and most appropriate definition for airport is a place from which aircraft operate that usually has paved runways and maintenance facilities and often serve as a terminal. Now let's decode it. A place from which aircraft operate. Here it means takeoff, landing, taxi, towing, pushback, ground handling, etc. That has paved runway means strong concrete stone or similar material strip having level surface and has maintenance facility that is where there are either small or large hangar or base to perform maintenance on aircraft and serve as a terminal that is which include all the facilities such as restaurants, lounge, walkaways, gates etc to handle the passengers. Now let us see the definition of aerodrome. Again, there are various definitions in different dictionary. The most appropriate is any area of land or water including ATC, basic facilities used for aircraft operation, either military or civilian, regardless of passenger facilities. Now in simple word, it can be any place either greenfield, commercial airport, military base or seaport having basic facilities such as ATC, ground support, necessary for smooth operation of either military or civil aircraft regardless of special facilities mentioned for the airport. To summarize the main difference, the airport and aerodrome has differences of facilities for passengers and aerodrome is actually a master term to denote any place from which aircraft operate successfully. It's like we can call aeroplane an aircraft but not aircraft an aeroplane. If you want to know the difference then check out our video on it by clicking i button and subscribe this channel to get such informative videos. Like aircraft and aeroplane, the airport and aerodrome is used. Every place is an aerodrome from which air operation takes place. An airport can be called aerodrome. The airport is the most common term used around the world to denote an airfield having all the facilities. While aerodrome is a term mostly used in Commonwealth English-speaking countries such as Australia, Canada, New Zealand, India, Singapore, UK, etc. are the few to name. The aerodrome is a word derived from ancient Greek language having air, that is air, and dormos, that is road or course meaning air course. Similar to race course, we use air vehicle, that's why air course or we called it aerodrome. Now, the airport is modern term first time used for battlefield outside Atlantic City, New Jersey in United States in the year 1910. Here, air is aircraft and port means field or place where it operates. The International Civil Aviation Organization ICAO, uses both terms in their articles. But they prefer airport over aerodrome slightly as airport is commonly used worldwide. We all have seen the differences. Now let us see some similarities. But before we see it, it's time to get the notes of Amy Module 3. The link to get Module 3 notes is provided in description of tips and tricks for clearing Module 3 video itself. And watch it for proper guidance and you are all set for clearing Module 3. I hope it will help you a lot. As we have seen the differences, it also included similarities itself. Number 1. Both places or defined area is used for operation of an aircraft. Number 2. Both places have fully functional basic facilities like air traffic controller, ground support, emergency support, etc. for smooth operation of an airspace. Number 3. Both are generally owned by national government and sometimes leased to private firms. That ends the really interesting differences and similarities between airport and aerodrome. I hope you learned something from it. Do let us know if you know any other differences and similarities in a comment section down below. And if you are still watching then here is your bonus.
There are mainly two types of airport, non-primary that is having less than 10,000 boarding passenger per year, while primary that is having more than 10,000 boarding passengers per year. Also we have subcategories which we will discuss in detail in upcoming videos. So make sure you subscribe that red button and click on bell icon to never miss our videos. See you in another video with another interesting topic. Till then, keep learning, keep watching, stay safe.